Hello, welcome to how to solve this very nice cubic equation x cubed plus 5x squared plus 8x plus 4 is equal to 0. We need to find all possible values of x. So, let's start. In this expression, here we have constant plus 4. The leading coefficient of this x cubed is 1. If we divide 4 by 1, 4 divided by 1, we get 4. And all possible factors of this 4 are plus or minus 1, plus or minus 2, and plus or minus 4. Now, we use a synthetic region to find at least one solution. Now, we write the coefficients of this expression in a row. First, we write this coefficient of x cubed 1. And then, we write the coefficient of this x squared plus 5. And then, we write the coefficient of this x 8. And then, we write this constant 4. Now, we try one of these factors. First, we try positive 1. This one will come down as it is 1 and we multiply this one by this one we get 1 we write that one here and we add these two terms this 5 plus this one will become 6 and we multiply this 6 by this one 6 times 1 we get 6 and we add these two terms 8 and 6 we get 14 and we multiply this 14 by this one, we get 14. And 4 plus 14 is 18. That is not equal to 0. We keep trying uh, this process until we get here 0. So now we let the second try as negative 1. Now we try negative 1. This one comes down as it is. We multiply this one by this negative 1. One time negative 1 is negative 1. And 5 plus the negative 1 is 4. Now we multiply this 4 by this negative 1. 4 times negative 1, negative 4. And this 8 plus this minus 4 is positive 4. We multiply this 4 by this negative 1. 4 times negative 1 is negative 4. And this 4 plus this negative 4 is 0. Means uh, x is equal to negative 1 is a solution. So, x plus 1 is a factor of this expression. Now, to get other factors, we use this row. Now, because here we have a third power of x and one power we have already written here. So, with this one we write a second power of x, x squared. And with this four we write a first power of x and this four remains constant. So, here we get the expression x squared plus 4 times x plus 4. Now, from here either this expression x plus 1 is equal to 0 or this expression x squared plus 4 times x plus 4 is equal to 0. From this equation, we get the value of x is equal to negative 1. This is the first value of x. This is the first solution of this equation. Now, to find the other two solutions, we solve this quadratic equation. We write this x squared as it is x squared. And we can write this 4 as plus 2 squared. Now, here we have x squared and here we have 2 squared. So, we write here plus 2ab plus 2 times 
in place of a we write x times in place of b we write 2 and this 2 times x times 2 is equal to this 4 times x and all this expression is equal to 0. Now, by using this uh, algebraic identity a squared plus 2ab plus b squared is equal to a plus b whole squared. This x squared plus 2 times x times 2 plus 2 squared will become x plus 2 whole squared is equal to 0. And this x plus 2 whole squared can be written as x plus 2 times x plus 2 is equal to 0. Now, from here either this expression x plus 2 is equal to 0 or this expression x plus 2 is equal to 0. From this equation we get the value of x negative 2 and from this equation we get the value of x negative 2. This is the second value of x and this is the third value of x. So, these are the three solutions of this equation.